<laughs> so what what are your top 3 uh, secrets uh, uh, you want to share uh, to all the audience who are joined us today to become financially uh, freedom dinesh ji the first one you have already spoken about and like we see people come to me asking where to invest to get the maximum returns and they have in their mind whether in real estate mutual funds stocks or crypto where to invest i tell them invest in yourself that's where, that's where you get the best returns wow what an amazing answer invest first you invest in yourself amazing See, yes in our early like uh, 20 years like where where, where our parents invested in us in terms of our education our health Absolutely. our Absolutely. upbringing our values and the kind of returns that we get based on that we can't compare it with any other asset class Absolutely. no other asset Absolutely. class can give that kind of return so that's the first secret i want to share with people that invest in yourself your mindset your uh, health like <laughs> as you were saying if you are investing in health you are saving on your medicine and your health <laughs> <laughs> yes <laughs> investing get a coach i'm a health and wellness coach and i can coach you on i can bet you and coach you on that your medicines ka kharcha will reduce for sure if you come to my uh, course and my academy yes yes dineshi number 1 okay then what what else uh, should we do second thing um, mindset we we need to work on like uh, if we find that rich people are not good <laughs> then you are programming yourself not to be rich because mm. you subconsciously you will never want to be not good you will want mm. to be someone good mm. so change your mindset don't think that rich people are bad they are doing something good that because of which they are attracting money and once we start doing that we need to adopt those good practices what they are doing learn from them and we will also start attracting money based on that fantastic fantastic because i was uh, right uh, when i was going through my book and uh, my book writing coach he was explaining that what do ambani's kids dream do they dream kal khana milega ki nahi milega no right they would dream abhi utna billion dollar ka kya khareedna hai kya business mein invest kar so big dreams you have and that that you know ki okay, money is bad money is this money is evil you have to uh, uh, come out of it and work on your mindset first yeah we uh, so have the start process uh, i earn good money by uh, doing good work if you start changing that that itself will uh, change yeah, yeah, yeah. the thought process is what i believe yes yeah so that's the second thing uh, like mindset is important part people don't realize the value of it people simply ask like where to invest tell me where <laughs> to invest and but inherently if they are carrying this bad mindset even if their asset class works well somehow the money will won't come to them or it will uh, they will lose it in some way or other mm-hmm. so it happens it happens like subconsciously like people don't realize it consciously they are trying to get money but subconsciously they are repelling money so oh. that uh, so that way mindset becomes a very important thing mm-hmm. and third thing uh keep that desire for learning like uh, ally we think mm. that learning needs to happen in that 20 years mein jo schooling college kiya bas uske baad mein i don't need like our education system is such that it develops that repulsion for learning ke learning to pata nahi slavery hai jaise <laughs> so but uh, if you have that appetite for learning then financial world is a like ocean for learning you like although every field is like health is ocean for learning and any field can become but i found like uh, i enjoy learning about finances for me if somebody is talking about finance i get involved in discussion and i find it a like very enthralling experience you, you can go go on and on. keep on learning very good same thing uh, dinesh uh, dinesh uh, i i share to my uh, students and even before coming to my uh, academy my to, to my coaching that in school in college we didn't l- learn about how to take care of our mind how to take care of our body and how to take care of our finances third one yeah yeah Correct. no life It, skill is taught no life no, skill is taught no no life skill is taught because when i was going through a rough patch and uh, uh, about uh, my health and uh, then finally I, through self study various courses article books and gurus and mentors i cracked the code and when i started reflecting i was like hare 
why did i not learn simple this is so simple to take care of my own mind and body why did i not learn in school and college i felt like that and same thing today even a large percentage will agree that they don't know how to manage their money because ye school or college mein nahi padhate so uh, friends all of you joining us today it's important to learn and learning doesn't mean you finish your school your college and start career or business and stop learn 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 yes learn about how health and wellness learn about how to manage money and in school and college we study physics chemistry maths biology hindi english marathi so many things and then latest is like uh, data science artificial intelligence yeah. chat gpt so 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 many things all these are superficial things actually. superficial exactly what is actually, that we have adopted this western education system uh, because of this slavery mindset we think this is good but we have forgotten the wealth of wisdom that lies in our ancient scriptures in my childhood exactly. like luckily in our school we used to have yoga classes mm-hmm. so mm-hmm. at that time we didn't realize the well now i realize the value like what amazing knowledge we were imparted in our school and uh, in my family like we used to have this gita uh, and other scriptures like uh, i used to read that now i realize the value of oh wow like it's such a wealth of information that i got like and it was pure by chance a um, mo- lot of people in india like forgetting about those things and just simply adopting these western things mimicking that mimic and but you know our own uh heritage is much much richer and much stronger than this western system absolutely totally agree with you